Green, a master's student with Kent State University. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you three different methods for baking chicken. Chicken is great because it pairs well with a lot of different seasonings, and knowing how to bake it well is a must. For this first method, we're going to go ahead and take a little bit of olive oil and brush it right on top of our chicken to help keep it moist while it bakes. Now next, you can sprinkle on any seasonings you like. Personally, I think that thyme and sage pair really well with chicken, so I'm just going to sprinkle on a little thyme and a little bit of sage. We're then going to put it on a baking sheet with a little spray of vegetable oil. And all three of these recipes are going to cook at 400 degrees. Put it right on and it's ready to go in the oven. The next method is going to be a dry rub. So for this recipe, we're gonna go a little south of the border and I'm going to pour on a little bit of paprika and cayenne pepper. Pour it on the one side, rub it in and give it a nice massage. Go ahead and flip it over and pour the rest of your seasoning right on top. And once again, rub it right in. So then it can go straight into a baking dish now, chicken breast is really flavorful and can be super tender, but it has a tendency to dry out. So always make sure to add a little bit of water or possibly even some chicken broth into your dish to make sure it doesn't dry out. All right, and the very last method I'm going to show you is marinating your chicken. To marinate your chicken, simply make some sort of marinade that uses a little bit of acid to help keep your chicken nice and tender. Put it in a nice Ziploc bag and put it in the bottom shelf of your refrigerator overnight or for a few hours during the day. Pop your bag open and simply dump it into a baking dish, pouring out the extra marinade as well. Go ahead and toss that away and now it's ready to bake as well. And all three of these recipes are going to bake uncovered in the 400 degree oven for 18 minutes. When your chicken is fully cooked, the meat will be white the juices will run clear, and a meat thermometer will read a minimum of 165 degrees Fahrenheit. So there you have it, three different ways to bake chicken. Thank you for watching.